Hey, what is going on guys? It is Temper Alliance, and in this video I'm going to be continuing the Xbox 720 and the PlayStation 4 talk on the information on a newspaper. And it is going to be part 2, and if you missed part 1, there will be an annotation on the screen, that's if I can really remember. But there will be an annotation on the screen to part 1, because I, I showed you guys a picture of the Xbox 720 and the PlayStation 4 that would possibly look like, it could possibly look like the machines that I showed you a picture of. Even though that made no sense, I don't think. But um, anyway, yeah. But I showed you a picture, and uh, I kind of read some bits on it, and I'm just going to continue on. So let's get started. And so where was I? Okay. And forget to talk about it being called the Xbox 720. The big money is on Microsoft taking a leaf out of Apple's book and keeping it simple with the machine simply named Xbox. Can gaming get any more realistic than it is now? Yes. Xbox will. Be a beast under the hood with four core processors fueling the fun. In layman's terms, that means it will make the highest end PC look like the lowest end PC. So basically, uh, what they're probably trying to say is Xbox is way better than PC. Well, it, it will be when Xbox 720 comes out because they're basically Microsoft is basically changing everything about it, and uh, PC it's just staying the same really. Um, In-game graphics will be almost movie quality, computer artificial intelligence will be frightening and sound will seem like it comes from every corner of your living room. So basically, um, Microsoft is basically changing the sound qualities and the quality itself. So basically, it's nothing like the Xbox 360 anymore and they're completely changing it. Uh, perhaps more exciting is some of the virtual reality stuff proposed. Connect 2.0 will be built into the main system and promises four player recognition and the sort of sensitivity that can detect the smallest finger movement. So basically, Connect 2.0 is now going to be a four player, not no longer a two player um, that was on the Xbox 360. I had to say though that um, the Connect on the Xbox 360 wasn't really the best as it, what I was hoping for. I thought it was going to be, you know, a lot better. But uh, it wasn't really great. I, I still have the Connect, but I I only use it for um, you know, voice command now because I, I think that's pretty cool. But I don't really play my Connect games on it. Like it's not really the best. But hopefully the Connect 2.0 will be um, better. Well, it has to because it's now for player. So yay. Uh, there's also talk of a feature called Amni Touch with the ability to beam 3D holographic images into your living room, which you will see in your via a pair of specially made glasses so basically they're changing the quality completely and um, they're going to change it to 3D so it's kind of basically like going to a 3D movie when you have to put on the glasses and everything but uh, you would probably need a 3D TV to do that sort of thing but which I don't, I don't have a 3D TV so um, I, I won't be able to do that but if you do then you'll probably be able to do this but you'll need glasses though uh, which kind of sucks. Um, but anyway, that's what you, you you really need to use anyway. Uh, the PlayStation 4 rumors are are scarcer, but Sony will almost certainly release a machine around November or just before. Now I don't know if they're on about the PlayStation. I don't know if he's on about the PlayStation 4 itself or is just yeah probably. What well, one of my thinking. Uh, so basically, if we can get the PlayStation 4 in around November or possibly sooner. And then uh, basically I'll probably get the PlayStation 4 first because it's like basically uh, a month's difference from the PlayStation 4 to the Xbox 720. I'll probably get both. Uh, I don't know. I'll have to see um, how my money is by then. But it's not until like another few months away. And uh, hopefully we'll be able to get our hands on it pretty soon. But there was rumors though about in 2014. Um, so, you know, maybe he's not right, but hopefully he's right, because it would be great if we have it in November. Anyway, the gameplay is going to pack up anyway, so I'm going to uh, so I'm gonna continue this in part 3. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did click that like button, it's, it's always appreciated on this channel. And, uh, yeah, once again, hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in the next video.